Okay, we're gonna see if we can get the uh, board forms removed here. It's been uh, sitting here for two days now. The concrete's dry and doesn't look like it's quite a hundred percent dry yet, but close enough. Uh, might be a little bit tricky getting those uh, middle inner boards out though. This might be interesting. Okay, folks, there we go. We got the uh, board forms off. It didn't turn out too badly. Even got the uh, forms out from the middle there. Getting these uh, side ones out were just a little bit uh, difficult. Ended up taking the uh, drain cover off there. Dropped the boards down in, then I could bring them straight up through. Uh, you can see we do have to clean out the bottom there. And the loose cement down in there. And yeah, with these uh, pieces here, we cut it into three pieces so we could get them out. At least that was the uh, theory anyway, and it seems to work. We can get them back in here anyway. There we go. One in. There we go. Back in business. Okay, now we're going to level this area out here. Get the tractor out and level out the remaining gravel. Of course, being careful to stay away from this here.
camera up here somewhere and we're going to start to level this out here. Uh, we're going to level out the stone pile that was in front of the barn there. I already pulled it back from the barn here a little bit. We're just going to kind of spread those out a little bit. And then uh, between the two drains there's kind of a dip down. So we're going to kind of level that back out. And like I said, of course, stay away from the drains a little bit there. We will try to not drive across the top of either one of those yet. And yeah, we'll just get this as level as we can. There we go. I think that'll about do it. Just need to uh, clean off the stones, off the cement there. Clean those off and maybe hit this with a rake here just a little bit. Uh, fill in around the cement yet. Or actually, I could probably just kick it in by foot too. Yeah, that looks pretty good. So anyway, with that, uh, if you folks have any comments or questions, be sure to uh, leave them below. And as always, thanks for watching and until next time.